This week is Teacher Appreciation Week, a time set aside to acknowledge and say thank you to educators. 2822 Eyewitness News reporter Julie Dunphy explains the importance of the recognition. They are telling us that they need to earn a professional pay and living wage so they can take care of their own families and not have to work two and three jobs to do those jobs that they love. Today is Teacher Appreciation Day. It's been a trying time for educators during the pandemic. In order to thank teachers properly, Becky Pringle, president of the National Education Association, has been listening to educators across the country about what they need. This year for Teacher Appreciation Week, we can't just say thank you with a coffee mug. We have to say thank you by saying, we hear you, we see you, and we will partner with you to get the resources and support you need to do the jobs you love. Ahead of Teacher Appreciation Week, Governor Tom Wolf spoke about the continued need to increase funding in schools across the Commonwealth, stating students and teachers in poorer school districts don't have the resources they need. Only because the Commonwealth of Pennsylvania has not lived up to its end of the bargain, which is to fund public education fairly and adequately. Funding is only one of many problems teachers face. The pandemic has also placed teachers under extra pressure from cases of school violence to teacher shortages. And they are telling us that they need help. They need more educators and community support to meet the growing needs that our students have. There are a lot of different ways families can show their appreciation to their teachers. Pringle says this week, along with a thank you gift, reach out to your child's teacher and listen to what their needs are inside and outside of the classroom. Julie Dunphy, 2822 Eyewitness News.